Here's one of the more unusual police chases you'll probably see. This is a police car dash cam video as someone tosses stolen chainsaws out of a minivan while police are in pursuit. Tonight, Duluth police are looking for the men who broke into a hardware store and stole those chainsaws and other items. Channel 2's Gwinnett Bureau Chief Tony Thomas is live at the Howard Brothers store with the exclusive video of the thieves in action. Tony? That Duluth police officer says when he pulled into the parking lot, there was an SUV parked right about here. It's back hatch open right up against the door. Now, this is 1.30 in the morning. Now, he says that SUV took off. He gave chase. And within a couple of minutes, the video shows he was dodging those chainsaws. That's chainsaw. Dash cam video from the officer's car shows one of the suspects kneeling in the back of the stolen SUV, tossing three chainsaws and a weed eater to the pavement. This officer would dodge them all and a large garbage truck as the suspects drove into oncoming traffic. I guess that, that was their opportunity to escape. At, the, at that point, get away is their power. Before the police arrived early Tuesday morning, Howard Brothers General Manager Tim Oliver's own security cameras would record the pair inside the store, efficiently carrying out the smash and grab. All they can carry quickly. Yeah. He said they're in there very short time. One minute. At one point, you can see one bandit trip with an armload of goods. The officer would apparently interrupt them, and the chase would last five minutes, with the suspects finally dumping the SUV and running into the dark. With no backup on scene, the lone officer would have to give up the chase. Didn't find him that night, but then again, you know, we suspect that they'll be found eventually. The Howard Brothers store has 13 of its 19 stolen items back. Although this chainsaw is in pieces after a responding officer ran over it trying to catch up with the chase. Oliver is just glad no one was hurt. It's just uh, another one of those, unfortunately, cost of doing business in today's world. And the only damage in all this, that one ruined chainsaw and about $3 damage to the police cruiser that struck it. Live in Duluth, Tony Thomas, Channel 2 Action News. Really unbelievable video. Thank you, Tony.